Good morning. This is Beatrice Vivius. It's 5 October 2019. Me and Frankie Two Socks from the For You to Fish campaign are here on the beach waiting for the whale train. We were going to walk, but um, the skies look a little bit wet. And if that water falls, we're going to be wet. So we decided to hang around, wait for the whale train. Just going to have a peepsy at um, Mapillon Bay, see what's going on, catch a lift back and get down to some serious emails and uh, blogging so we can um, get what Frank calls consumptive tourism back on track in the Isimangalisa Wetland Park area. Now those are the guys that used to come down with the long rods on their cars, with the mattresses on the boots and the trailers and they, their financial contribution to the park is what has built the park into the world recognized institute it was when we got World Heritage Site status. And um, yeah, we pretty much want that back. The old KwaZulu Natal Park Sport Management Plan that was um, founded in 1953. It worked very well until 1999. So, um, Isimangliso Wetland Park now being a donor organization or an organization living from surviving from the nations I don't see why it's it's necessary anyway guys you can make your contributions towards the for you to fish and project work and revive St. Lucia campaigns by sending us airtime MTN there's the number or um, Telco Mobile there's the number and even Vodacom a number I supplied so yeah follow these hashtags Revive St. Lucia Project Work and For You To Fish and support us comment on our, our entries give us your suggestions so that we can um, get the government to focus more on what is needed for the people rather than affirmative shopping or what they call redistribution of wealth. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel and um, like the Facebook album that you got this video from. Remember, follow the album, press like in that order. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Okay, look at all this um, mud build up here. Just left of the ski boat club. All the way across. It's dry all the way across. Let's show you. Right guys, this is now with the new camera, now I can show you how shallow the water is, although I can't see, this is just to the left of the ski boat lap.
as uh, Frankie Tussock says, they don't even have their feet in the water. And if we look a little bit more towards the sea, look at all that mud. We turn a little bit that way. Sorry, I'm still getting used to all the zoom power. But look at all that mud.